welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to the family. Please like, comment, and subscribe as you're coming in to show some support. Remember, it's energy exchange, okay? Put yourself where you belong in this story. It could be your story. It couldn't even, it, it might not even resonate, all right? So always use your discernment, okay? I have music playing in the background. So it's about choices here. You can watch if you don't have to. But please, try to take something from it if you're seeing this. It's meant to be. So, spirit guides, ancestors, oracles of the highest white light. Please give me a guided, clear, precise channel message as to what my collective needs to know. See, feel, today on this beautiful night. Okay? Anything other than the highest white light, please close that door now. Thank you. So grab your tea, grab your drink, grab your <laughs> tree, depending, okay? Do whatever you need to do to get comfortable, basically. I'm confuddled, so somebody is confuddled, okay? They're living the gangster's paradise, I think. I don't know, but they're stumbling on their words. They got me facing I can live a normal life. I was raised by the shit, justice. For my hood and cheese. Got me chasing dreams. I'm an educated fool with one hand on my mind. Got a pain in my hand and a pain in my eye. I'm a big black face, a set to the King of Pentacles in reverse. Yo, there's justice to somebody who is very greedy. What can I say? Somebody doesn't know if they're gonna survive this. It's the sun in reverse with the two of wands. They knew what they were doing. It's a choice, right? It's a choice to stay in the dark, right? Yo, if somebody is choosing this depression, you know, and it's only out of greed, it's out of envy and spite, the lovers, somebody is choosing love now, though, remember, it's always a choice, the two of wands with the lovers next door to it, and the that, I mean, uh, not the devil, the devil's not here, jumping the fucking gun, but there's a lot of depression here, somebody is choosing not, yeah, the nine of swords, Somebody's upset because nobody taught them, okay? The Nine of Swords, they're very up in their head. They never were taught what love was. With the lovers, they were, they feel like their life is out of luck because they were a fool with the Three of Cups. Third parties are dwelling a lot. This is what people, somebody in this depression is because of their environment. The Six of Swords, it's time to move away, guys, from this bullshit. Inevitably, justice does get served. Temperance Angel with the Eight of Swords in reverse. It's time for you to get out of this jail, this mental prison. You're not blind. You're not trapped. You see it. Are you and me? Why are we so blind? Somebody doesn't see somebody as an Earth Angel. This Earth Angel doesn't. And we can, we're all earth angels, guys, but we have to go with love. Somebody is moving away or somebody chose to move away from an earth angel. Like, this earth angel is, uh, I, what I'm getting from the earth angel, I'm not going to lie, okay? It's somebody is bringing balance. They're having patience. They're really going inwards to get out of this mental entrapment that they've been in for so long. Now, this is a 90s playlist, so who knows what the fuck's going to come on, okay? Bear with me, all right? It's a... It's a surprise. <laughs> now, we have the Queen of Swords in reverse. So there's some kind of narcissistic energy. Somebody was very abusive, very con conniving, condescending, and lied on a, on a temperance angel. This is why there's so much karma. It's the Three of Wands in the upright, the Five of Wands in the reverse, the Prince of Pentacles in reverse, and the Three of Swords in reverse. So what it's telling me right off the bat is this narcissistic person here, this Queen of Swords, somebody who is not logical, somebody who is not authentic, somebody who is uh, jealous and spiteful that they lie, you know? Anyways, there's... <laughs> there, there's some waiting, okay? Somebody's waiting on something. And it's... 
to put down this fighting, this bickering, this confusion. Oh, it's way over there. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> so there's some kind of not being a not okay so somebody wants some shit to go all awry okay but the show must go on and see what I mean okay somebody is really 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 trying to get up in your energy okay and block something cause a lot of fighting a lot of bickering but it's in reverse it's not working whatever this queen of swords is trying to get on somebody it's not working because there's um somebody okay since you've been gone i can do whatever i want is what it's saying fucking <sighs> Three of Swords, somebody has gotten out of this heartbreak and this despair of these third parties that is an earth angel. And this is why somebody hates them. Because you eat dinner at fancy restaurants and you don't fucking gloat about it. You don't tell people what you're doing. You don't tell people who you're helping. Somebody's upset. Because nothing compares to you. Wow. All right, y'all. Like I said, somebody's really tra causing, trying to cause you some kind of confuddle, but it, I just seen a flipper. Yeah, yeah they're causing, look, it's the seven of cups with the chariot in reverse. They want to cause you some kind of uh, misleading or uh, have a lot of options or be confused in some kind of haze or something, you know, they, they, this, this, um, queen of swords energy, this narcissist, male or female, remember, put yourself where you belong, we hold both masculine and feminine energies internally, wants you to be confused so you don't move towards something or you're very jaded or, and not getting to the destination that you seek, but somebody is really balancing out this energy and really going inward. And letting go, you're not blinded, you're not blinded, and you see the gangster's paradise. Yo, I lived that paradise land for a long time, yo. It's not fucking paradise, someone died on the streets, yo. Look, someone's dwelling on the past, nine of wands in reverse, and the, the strength. Somebody is really dwelling on the third parties here. And they're having a lot of sleepless nights because they buckled under pressure. They're feeling broken, but they can do this. We can all do this. All right. If this is you, you have the strength to persevere, to walk away from what no longer serves you from this greed, this envy, this depression. Yo, you can because the justice is there. Now, the justice on the 3D is different from the justice in the 5D. It is what it is. Somebody is dwelling so much because of this confusion that somebody has them in or some kind of a illusion. There's a lot of fantasy here, you know? Somebody needs to get out of their head is what it comes down to because they're just fucking themselves up with the environment that they're around or that they're listening to or... Yeah, the star is in reverse with the Prince of Cups in the upright, the judgment in reverse, and the world... <sighs> the four of swords somebody is need to rest need is praying i'm not gonna lie yo they're fucking really praying but they're they're getting the protection they need to sit on their truth they need to think about their truth never mind what's going on or if anybody even knows their fucking truth it's not of anybody's business all right you need to deal with you you need to give yourself the love and compassion because there's no healing here and it's because of a refusal to see yourself and you know that acceptance that that there's a there's a closed chapter here when one door closes another one opens and somebody's upset because of the fact that wait do i have a flipper here that mm, nothing compares to you like somebody is looking and like thinking this okay four of wands with the fool when one door closes another one opens okay there's a cycle here there's foundation there's celebration but you have to get out of your own way. Understand it's about choices. We choose this. Suffering is a choice, guys. There's stability here. 
could talk about a marriage, could talk about a relationship, could talk about a business partnership. There's a lot to be grateful for, guys. But just because people don't talk about it doesn't mean it's not there. Spying. Somebody's spying on this new beginning, and this is why it's better not to say anything. Ace of Wands with the Four of Pentacles, okay? There's a brand new beginning coming in. Very, very bad. But you're holding on to it tight because you know people are spying. And it's the Ace of Pentacles with the Five of Wands. Pentacles, like I said, they're just spying because they know they missed out on a, a gift, an opportunity, a blessing. Or they want to take your blessings and leave you out in the cold. So take it as it resonates. Somebody is either feeling left out in the cold from your blessings because they walked away from it. You know, they're dwelling, and now they're spying on your foundation and your new beginning. Take it as it resonates. Or somebody wants to take your blessings, to leave you out in the cold. This is why it's best not to say anything. And to just have the inner strength to know what's yours is coming. And there's a lot to be grateful for. Okay, let's see what's going on here with this fucking Prince of Swords. You know, somebody is learning something new. They're learning how to heal. Okay, they're learning to take some time. They're learning how to get over get over being a fucking player, yo, big papa. You're look Somebody needs to heal from this energy. This queen Okay, you have the Queen of Swords, King of Swords, yo. They need to heal from this narcissistic energy. This this couple, this group is spying on you. Ten of Cups because you have emotional fulfillment. And there's a player. They for them streets. Like I said, I used to be for them streets too, but yo, this is a hoe. Yo, that's a whole different kind of street style, you know? Let's check this out. What's going on? Yo, somebody is getting busted. The truth. Knight of Swords. I mean, Ace of Swords, Knight of Pentacles. They're spying on you. They, they're learning something. They're getting clarity on something. And uh, they see that they're a true fucking player. <laughs> the Knight of Pentacles talks about somebody who's single. Self-sufficient, independent, okay? Some, somebody's learning something about equilibrium. The Six of Pentacles. My God, went crazy. The Wheel and the Hierophant. Somebody loves when they when you call them Big Papa, but they're about to shoot up the place, though, yo, because the wheel, and somebody sees you as higher level commitment, and they want to have your baby wheel. They know that's your wheel of fortune, yo, your success. They want to come in and bring some balance, but the prince of princes of swords, yo, there's some kind of spying, lying, there's somebody lying on you, yo, could be these narcissistic energy, trying to block this fucking blessing to come in, this is why you don't say shit, and you, because look, the, like I said, the queen of cups, the queen of cups in the upright is loving, kind, generous, intuitive, now somebody is with the wheel of fortune trying to block you, trying to cause a lot of distraction, a lot of uh, not good things, yo, let me see what's going on here, they're jealous, they're jealous because they want, they're, you're smoking L's in the jacuzzi, this queen of pentacles with the higher font in reverse, okay, yeah, somebody doesn't want this um, wife, this uh, matriarch, this mother figure, this boss woman, take it as it resonates, it could be a male, to uh, have a relationship, they're blocking the blessings, Prince, princess of wands, but there's a message coming in, somebody really does have a lot of passion for what they do, now I got a download a while ago and I wrote it down, it says someone is upset about the work you do or have done, okay, it says how are you gonna win if you ate right with it, yeah, somebody's turned, they're mad, mad, six of cups, because somebody is coming in with a lot of love in spite of the disapproval of others in the background, yo, you're getting some kind of fucking blessing, like I said, there's a lot to be grateful for, princess of cups, but somebody's got no self-love, and ew, <laughs> Yeah, that's the, the prince, yeah. Somebody's playing a nigger like a dummy, or excuse my language, but the princess of cups in reverse with the head of pentacles. Somebody used somebody. 
for their money, for their finances. Maybe they had a baby with them and to trap them. Yo, this is dirty, dirty. So you got to be careful if the company you keep, guys, because somebody doesn't have any self-love. Three of Pentacles. You got to be careful of the people you work with. Nine of Pentacles. Somebody wants to work with you. They see you as wish fulfillment after going through this really fucked up situation with the devil. Somebody is obsessed with you. I'm not going to lie. Eight of Pentacles. They want to work with you. They're really obsessed with working with you. They're obsessed with the work that you do. Ten of Wands. And they want to let go of any kind of burdens. Or they see you're letting go of some kind of burden. That where people were trying to leave you out in the cold. Princess of Pentacles. You're getting a brand new beginning. Yo, it's fucking beautiful. It's a job uh, pay raise, a job. Remember, like, there's a lot to be grateful for. Somebody is the hangman, the six of wands, the tower, and the prince of wands, and all in the upright. Somebody is sacrificing something. Somebody is uh, feeling like, you know, a little bit stuck, but they're looking at things in a different perspective as to how they can get this victory, this public recognition, or this internal praise, you know, this you know, get out of this um, sun in reverse and all this chaos and confusion. There's a tower. So somebody is blowing up their life, jumping out and like whatever is built on faulty foundation and it will be crumbled. Somebody really feels like uh, they don't know what to do when they break down this castle this crap ass castle that they built but they're gonna be able to build on a, a, a strong foundation after that and they're gonna go towards their passion with the prince of wands okay they're they have a lot of passion yo king of cups but somebody is trying to block this and with the magician somebody is trying to manifest or manipulate a situation to block the emperor from coming in it's a king of cups in reverse, okay? Somebody, male or female, somebody who is emotional, a manipulative, water sign. It's the ace of wands, the two of cups in reverse, and the moon in reverse. They're trying to block this passion to put them in a two of cups environment, okay? In reverse. So it's like a partnership, a lover, a friend, but there is no equilibrium. And this is why somebody is still depressed. But the light is coming. This, whatever's in the dark is coming to light. It's in reverse. So you're going to get the answers you seek about this brand new passionate big dick energy. But somebody's still trying to keep you trapped in something. But the hermit is there with the seven of wands and the seven of pentacles. Yo, that's seven, seven. Somebody is getting a lot of wisdom internally. Wow, all these cups that... Uh, okay. Yeah, somebody is getting wisdom about this... Um, this king of cups, this emotionally unstable person so that they can go towards their two of cups, flip it over. Because whatever's in the dark with this two of cups is coming to light for this emperor. Because he sees, he went into hermit mode, he lit up this lantern and now there's a manifestating here, okay, to protect. Some kind of boundaries are being set so that there could be an investment here for this emperor. Death. A transformation, okay? Uh, could be a physical death. You know, it looks like the ancestors got their foot on somebody's throat because somebody has a lot of love and it's, oh, wow, it was the Queen of Cups, okay? Somebody has a lot of love for this Queen of Cups um, and, and is trying to balance out resources to learn how to put down their guard but at the same time protect this person who is very uh, valuable, Ten of Cups who is somebody's ten of cups, emotional fulfillment, happiness, joy. They want to get out of the dark. They want to bring justice. There, there's a king of wands energy in reverse. Promiscuous. This is that uh, big papa energy, okay? Very good looking, but it's, it's really that dirty dick kind of energy if you really think about it. But... At the end of the day, it is, could not be that energy. It could just mean somebody is just arrogant. Four of Wands. No, you let go of this toxic energy, whether it was a past energy that you were holding or the energy you're sitting in now. You choose to walk away from this energy. It's the Four of Cups. 
the five of swords, the ten of swords in reverse, and two of swords. Now you're choosing to be blinded or naive by a situation somebody's choosing not to see. But what it comes down to is someone's feeling very left out from this cup of love. They didn't, they didn't take it before, and they chose to dwell in these third parties because it was good, right? It's the lifestyle. They thought that's what everybody was doing, and so they're going to join along, you know? And they took for granted something that was there. And now they're seeing how the Five of Swords, somebody's feeling defeated because of what they have done to others or what they allow to happen to them. I'm really feeling like somebody was mean to somebody but then went into a relationship or a partnership and, and, you know, that person that they were mean to before was innocent. And now in this situation, they are innocent. It's called karma, yo. But somebody is coming in from the past to bring in some kind of equilibrium, okay? To balance out your energy and then, you know, so forth. I have no idea, but there's a letting go, okay? There's no longer dwelling. You're not a victim. There is no victims here, okay? Somebody's a creep. Yo, this is the fucking dirty energy I was talking about, yo. You gotta fucking be careful. Remember, if you're sleeping with somebody and they're sleeping with... You're sleeping with all those people that that person slept with, yo. Take care of your body. Somebody is being naive to this energy. Seven of Swords. Somebody is lying. There's a lot of deception. See, somebody, all they tell me is lies. High Priestess, you're going to have to use your intuition about a situation because somebody is... High Priestess, Empress... Somebody is standing in their power and use their intuition about all these creepy ass energies, eight of cups, that wanted them to not move away into the new chapter and stand as this beautiful, vibrant, magnetic person. There's a message coming in. Fast moving message could be a download. But somebody is a fucking warrior, takes no fucking bullshit, and is showing people really what the fuck is up, and who is really what. Somebody can't get a message through until they get out of a jail or mental entrapment to bring celebration. They want to celebrate, but there's a mental entrapment because you're an earth angel. It's about choices, guys. Somebody is like that pick me bitch where they're fucking constantly they don't care what the person does as long as they're laying next to them like yo that's fucked up have some self respect yo the king of pentacles the world there's a an incompletion here you're gonna have to walk away from what no longer serves you prince of wands somebody has too much passion the wheel in reverse and it's causing them a really lot of uh, loss they're losing Prince of Cups. Somebody sees somebody as a mule. It's this Queen of Pentacles who is in the upright, the matriarch, the whites. They're learning something, guys. Somebody needs to sit down, take some fucking notes, and really start respecting their body because, yo, someone's on the fucking. It says, release your ex. Yo, release your ex because your ex is creeps. The time has come to clear your energy, wifey. It's time for you to be a wife, yo. Never mind all this bullshit that's going on around because, yo, at the end of the day, you're a star. Empress High Priestess, yo, you don't play no fucking games. Okay? <laughs> My download is so funny. It says, get it right, get it tight, yo. Somebody is a fucking creep and they ain't getting no tight shit because they ain't got it right. So they got bum bitches around them, yo. I'm gonna keep it fucking clear. They scared. They scared of this wifey or this mother because she's giving, yo, one more. Sorry, guys, one more, okay? Yeah, look, I just said mother, right? When I say it, it comes in some soulmate. Somebody sees you as a mother, they're soulmate, and they're scared of what they did or situation, or they're scared of their mother because you're their soulmate. Take it as it resonates. Just bullshit, yo. Somebody needs to do well by you. That's what it fucking comes down to, yo. Have a mind of your own. Because somebody's a temperance angel, balance, practicality, spirituality, and there's a fucking tower, yo, for anybody who goes against 
Energy never lies. Uh -huh. Energy never lies. Yo, it is what it is. Somebody chose a bomb over a boss, and now they're realizing that love conquers all, and the Tower of Truth is hitting everybody. Boom! Rock a bye, baby. Ancestor. And. And send, uh, ascended master, you are a fucking ascended master, and doors are opening to you. So be blessed, be grateful, guys. The Tower of Truth is coming in. Love conquers all, yo. People, people be choosing craziness, but uh, later on they realize they were shoot. <laughs> so it is what it is, yo. They're going to hell for choosing this bunk over pure love and now these dirty photos are coming out on people and you're living the good life while they're behold they're going through power yo here i go again won't damn <laughs> chilling minding my business solo dolo i swear i swear my niece my witness somebody's homeless yo but that's okay because they're not broke they're maybe broke busted but they're not they're not dead they can get better these cloud chasers yo they're homeless they have no heart something happened in the winter is gonna happen in the winter it's about self-care somebody is gonna go towards self-care you do that you do Make you, <laughs> you have a right to know, okay? You have the confidence to defeat these energy vampires. They're stuck and they're going to judgment. Because <laughs> they fuck with a temperance angel. <clears throat> but like that. Can it get a smile with a shake, shake, booty? Looks could kill you, will be a newsie, you a shotgun. Bang! What's up with that thing? I wanna know. How does it hang? Straight up, wait up, hold up, Mr. Lover. You a sexy mother. What? <laughs> the lovers. By my karma. Do something. Come and give me some of that yum, yum, hot. Can I get a scoop? In my coop. <laughs> Somebody wants to shoot. The strength, they love your strength, yo. Somebody is feeling a little bit pathetic because they see your fucking strength. You're a fucking goat. And they tried to take the goat out. But you know trust is everything, and they were just jealous of an empress. To the subject, that who is in hermit, very wise, intelligent. These people are slackers, and that's why they're feeling a little bit pathetic. This Virgo, you could be a Virgo, because you're the sun. You're enlightening all kinds of luck. You're enlightening, you're helping all kinds of people, and it's allowing you to be self-made. On your mark, get set, go, let me go, let me shoot to the next man in the three-piece suit. I spend all my dope, ray me cutie, shoot shooba doobie like scooby dooby doo I like you in your big jeans. You make me want to scream, ooh, 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 I like what you do, when you do, hierophant, time for love, ha, <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Higher level commitment, guys. Remember, stand your ground through this word magic, all right? Because you got a pure heart. Because you are earth angels. Boy, look at him. You're earth angel. Two, two, two. Taurus, okay? You have the heart to uplift everyone around you like an earth angel. Libra. Bittersweet, all right? You're doing, somebody is just doing way too fucking much. And he's just, they're trying to control shit, yo. And the magic is being backfired for the Scorpio or the death, yo. Fool. Life purpose. Somebody's starting brand new and going towards their life purpose in the winter with some self-care. Gemini talks about the twins. You're doing the right thing by doing this, so go for it, okay? It's going to allow you to open up some doors. But somebody's being stubborn. But you're helping all kinds of people, so they're listening. Believe me, they hear you loud and clear. But they're envious, they're spiteful, they're pitiful, and they're trying to set you up. The Wheel of Fortune, you got it, though. That's why they're trying to set you up. But you ended the cycles. It's meant to be, yo. It's what is yours is yours. It's coming either way. People need to get ready. Buckle up and hold on tight. Because the tower of truth is there. And shit is blowing up. It's about change. 
forgiving and learning. As you release and heal the past, you experience more love in your present situation. Spiritual words. This is the truth, guys. New love. A new person has stirred your romantic feelings. Release your ex. Remember, children, okay? Your love life is being affected by children. Codependency, yo. Addictions are affecting your romantic life. And it says, this could be the one. You're ready to... You already met the romantic partner that you seek, all right? So let's get some advice from the universe. Spirit guides, ancestors, let's get some advice from the universe. All right, we got the fourth house, okay? Culture, family, roots, home, peace, and comfort. This is what it's about, guys. Somebody is, you know, got shit down packed. The square, a challenging situation, a mountain to climb. We're always going to have a mountain to climb. Even if you think we have everything together, there's always going to be uphill battles. There's always going to be something to heal. Something is always going to come in right in our face, you know? Especially if we're creative, we can get creative blocks, you know? But it's about healing that hurt and understanding and really going towards those challenges, understanding that it's about divine timing. It's about having balance in your fourth house, your home, your structure, your stability, the earth, stability, being grounded. It's about persistence, patience, and practicality. What you do on a daily basis is exactly who you are, guys. Trying. Angelic support, harmony, and a perfect flow. You have support to go with the perfect flow of life. Trust yourself. Trust the bigger plan. Remember, even if you're like in this this player energy, yo, you can still get out. Yo, look at me. I'm good. Spirit of empowerment. Like I fucking said. Spirit of intuition. You need to use your intuition to really empower yourself and others. Remember that your testimony will help somebody else, okay? So be authentic to your core values and be honest. And believe me, the people who love you are going to still love you, but you got to be honest with yourself and bring back your, uh, your, um, your light, you know, your, your peace, your joy, you know, bring, bring back your, your son. Abundance. Bring back your fucking abundance, yo. But you're going to have to be courageous and to get this companion. I don't fucking make it up. It is what it is, guys. Let's get some more. Yeah, high priestess of light, okay? Let's get some more clarity from a high priestess of light for some more guidance. Okay, somebody's using sacred action, okay? They're, they have decisive focus. They know exactly what they want and they're going towards it. And it's a friendship, okay? Partnership, business partnership. It's about finding support, mutual friends, having fun, unity, and play. Okay? Now, there's adjustments that are needing to be required, which means you have to go back in order to move forward, all right? To build your own world. Yo, it's about creation, expansion, and networking. We can all do this, guys. But remember, the company you keep is where you're going to go. So, healing earth. The power to receive and give healing is equilibrium. You're going to have to use your clairvoyance, okay? Use that inspiration to interpret what you're healing. I mean, what you're hearing to trust yourself, okay? Because you're innovative. You're creating something new to show the world. But you're going to have to set boundaries. There's a threshold of protection around you. So remember to be quiet about what's going on because you have a divine masculine coming in. Yo, I don't fucking make it up. Somebody is going to help you to activate your power and help you to set, um, to protect you. It's beautiful, guys. Let's get the last closing message, all right? All right, let's get one more advice, okay, from me. Subconscious dreams and the universe. Or, I mean, yeah. What's the subconscious want to tell you? Okay. The subconscious wants to tell you you're a fucking god or goddess. All right? The, embrace the feminine. Create and be gentle, nurturing, yet strong. Do not listen to those who want to keep you small. Believe that you are important as the stars in the heaven. 
Get it right, get it tight. Remember, <laughs> go with the flow. You can't control life's events. You can only control how you deal with them. It's easier to go with the flow when life challenges you. Emotions can overflow unless you release them. Death. Your subconscious wants you to ask yourself, what parts of you and your habits need changing? How do you feel disconnected with yourself and others? And how have you been neglecting your physical or emotional health? Water. Ask yourself, what is overwhelming you in your walking life and waking life? How are you traveling emotionally in life and are you struggling to reach your goals? Connections. We are all connected by a universal sea of energy. All that you think and do have effect on the world. So reach out and connect to the world around you through love. Remember, it's a spider web. This is why I love to do what I do and I get, you know... It, it's a spider web. Instead of spreading the hate and the slander and the negativity, we're spreading love, we're spreading enlightenment, we're spreading healing. And we're getting prosperity for it because we trust ourselves through the journey. It says, give and expect the universe to give back to you. Believe that you are prosperous already. Have gratitude for everything you have in life. Trust. Trust yourself and the universal plan for you. I don't make it up. Do not give the tr your trust to others lightly. When one door closes, another one opens. Intuitive Tasha, yo. Play. It's time to play. To feed your own inner child. To find someone who's going to do this with you as well. That child card is, you know, somebody is is being affected by children because they they can't get it right inside, yo. It's like... How, how are you going to win if you're not right within, right? Find time to incorporate play in your everyday life. Allow your inner child to experience joy. You deserve to be happy and joyous around others. Okay, empowerment. Believe, your, believe in your own power to create, change, and control your life. Be empowered by becoming an example for others and to others. Use your past experiences to make yourself stronger. Like I said, your... your your testimony is going to help people bring justice to their situation, to really allow them. You're helping people. Even if they're stubborn, you're still planting that seed. And don't ever, ever, ever underestimate the power of planting that seed, guys. It's beautiful. So let's let the last closing message. I hope that this resonated. I hope it helped you for this for tonight or, you know, on this journey that you've been on this last little while because it's not... It's not easy for a lot of people right now, so you need to understand you're not alone, okay? Somebody really needs to do something because my card went up in my tree. It's number three. They need to get right. Mind, body, soul. Get it right. Get it tight. And they'd be able to get somebody real tight. But right now, they're about with a bunch of loosey-goosey people. Or take it as it resonates. It's just a loose energy, okay? <laughs> the mirror and the candlelight. <laughs> let your light shine. Okay, so let me uh, get up here. Oh, wow, we have the devil on my floor. <laughs> so guess what, guys? Somebody is obsessed with you. It is what it is, right? There's nothing we can do about that. But number three, why do you not see your shining light within you as others do? Are you afraid of revealing, which is, what are you afraid of revealing, which is stopping you, you from discovering your true potential? The time has come to remove the mask and show the world that's your true self. You feel your need to protect yourself from emotional harm, but you have nothing to fear from stepping into the limelight as things can only change for the better. If you feel you're being blocked, this is a little, with a little effort, you can push through the difficult period in your life and conquer whatever is holding you back. You are on a brink of change. You just need to the encouragement and support to know you are headed in the right direction. The light ahead of you shines brightly and opportunities are calling uh, don't allow fear of the unknown to stand in your way embrace the challenges ahead they will be the makings of you yo i don't fucking make it up <laughs> i hope this resonated i hope it helped you if you want a more personal reading i'll put all my information at the bottom okay guys i really appreciate all the likes the comments and the subscriptions somebody's stumbling on their words <laughs> So am I. <laughs> I hope this resonated, okay? Bye.